like a foolish donkey. Rani, did you finish your homework? No, Mama. But why? You have to show it to your teacher tomorrow. Mama, I'm having headache. Mm, my hand is paining. But you were all right. Mm, Mama. Hey, I think you are finding ways to avoid your work. Mama, I'll do my homework afterwards. I think you need to know this story. Which story, Mama? The Foolish Donkey. In a village, there lived a merchant. who would load sacks full of salt on his donkey's back every morning and go to the market. On the way, they had to cross a river. One day, the donkey accidentally fell into the river. The salt dissolved in the water and the weight of the sacks reduced. Next day, the donkey was carrying some more sacks of salt. He thought, If I again fall into the water, my burden will become less. He fell purposely. The salt dissolved in the water and the sacks again became lighter. The donkey continued doing so for another two, three days and was feeling proud of himself. Hee ha, hee ha, how intelligent I am, how smart I am, ha ha ha, I can easily fool merchant, hee ha, hee ha. But unfortunately, Merchant understood the trick of Donkey and thought of teaching him a lesson. Next day, the Merchant loaded a sack full of cotton on the Donkey's back. The Donkey played the same trick and purposely fell into the river, hoping that the load will get lighter. But the wet cotton became heavier and heavier and the donkey had to suffer a lot to carry it. Moral of the story Don't find ways to avoid your work and do your duty honestly. Now did you understand Rani what I meant when I said don't waste your time and don't find ways to avoid your work and your duty.